It's literally 10 degrees with about a three, three degree wind chill out there. You can't hear anything. Everything is silent. Burke hit the fullback. I've seen that before, I have. I've heard it before and I've fucking cracked up just like that. <laughs> He's getting into him, isn't he? You're fucking too old, mate. What are you doing? How? How in the world are you doing this? Sup, guys? How are we doing? Welcome back to another video. Welcome back to another Rugby Player Reacts to American Football um, type of video. There, there is many, many types of videos on this channel. Certainly not all reaction videos. In fact, reaction videos make up less than 50% of the videos on my YouTube channel. And the amount of times I've reacted to Tom Brady, I could probably almost count on one hand, but we're gonna add at least two more. In the last video, we looked at Tom Brady, Five Rings. It's a documentary type piece from Joseph Vincent, who's an absolute YouTube legend, especially in the world of sports and telling stories. I enjoyed that one. I hope you guys did too. What we're going to do now is, is move on to six rings. Following that, we're going to move to seven rings and we're going to call it a day there. I'd forgotten how well Joseph Vincent edits videos. He's a magician behind the lens. Um, well, behind the editing suite at the very least. He's got 962,000 subscribers and I'm going to say within a month, he'll get to a million. So whether he's at a million subscribers by the time that you see this video or not, he is certainly on that up, upward trajectory and it only happens when you put in the work. It only happens when you do have a quality product and that's what I'm trying to bring to my channel. At the moment I've got 141,000 subs and I am absolutely uh, forever grateful to all of you who've decided to sub to my channel and, and enjoy my content. So at the very least, I'm going to say it right here right now, if you enjoy my content enough to watch every single video, why not hit the like button as soon as you arrive? Because I'm thinking that people most likely do want to hit the like button, but you might forget. And I mean, if a YouTuber doesn't actually put a call out at the start of a video telling you to like it or, or asking you to like it, um, there's many people that, that just simply don't. Um, whether that's because you actually dislike it or whether that's because you've forgotten, I don't know, but I'm going to say right now, please hit that like button if you do enjoy it. And with that being said, um, let's get into it. To control the other rings, he needs the one. And that ring was lost long, long ago. You know, we've said it before. Father Time has no idea where Tom Brady lives. None. And it is the magic number six. Michael Jordan, the greatest athlete in history of American team sports, has six champions. Touchdown, Patriots, as they tie Super Bowl 52. Hang on, the Eagles won that, right? Boy, if the Eagles can come up with their one turnover of the game right Michael here. Michael Jordan, the number six, is a big deal. If he gets his LeGarrette game. Blount played an absolute Eagles blinder. In fact, Blount won a Super Bowl with the Patriots and the Eagles, I'm led to believe. If that's completely wrong, forgive me. Tom Brady and I lost the Super Bowl to Nick Foles. See, see, how much do you think the outcome of the Super Bowl will impact Tom Brady's legacy? Oh my God, they're saying it again. Look, they were saying back in 2005 he was done. They were saying in 2015 he was, and effectively in 2017 he was done. But he's still making the Super Bowl. <laughs> Don't you get it? He's playing till he's 50. Brady lost the fumble that changed the game. That was the reason why the Eagles won. There is a vision in the more ancient. Now, all that is going to do is just increase that chip that he's always had on his shoulder. A pit where men are thrown and suffer. Yes, the answer is the cliff has arrived. Uh, and if, and I do not believe Brady will be a great quarterback this year. The 
that sometimes a man rises from the darkness. Sometimes the pit said something about it. Let's not stand on ceremony here. You admit defeat if he has a great week. Well, I would say by the letter of the law, yeah, I would have to give that up. Okay, so the, the theme of this is clearly the Lord of the Rings. Not only that, but it's losing the Super Bowl in 2017 uh, to the Eagles and coming back and winning his sixth in 2018 against the Rams. A game that I actually watched live on this channel. If you want to see my reaction to that game, not the actual game, but watching it as a live stream with you guys, it's on the channel. I believe it was February 2019 and I was in a place called Cairns. Boring game. When it ends, then I will say, oh, it's over. And that'll probably be when Tom Brady decides to stop punishing all of us. Yeah, punishment. Must be nice to be. Are there other people against Greg? The people, the cliff people. The what? There's four letters. The cliff. Letter, the cliff. The cliff. I've heard people say he's going to fall off a cliff five years ago. Okay, in two more years, he's going to fall off a cliff. See, it's interesting. Those players are saying that the ball's coming out so quick, right? But looking back at Tom Brady's college football pro day or combine um, footage, that ball wasn't coming out quick. So he has not. He, he's he's developed his game throughout his NFL career, and so at age like 40, the ball is coming out faster at the age of 40 than it was at the age of 20. And to think about that is a bloody miracle. Thing that he's done this year. 17 years ago, we were the largest underdogs in the history of the Super Bowl. And we're taking on the exact same franchise. Man, that first Super Bowl against the Rams, the greatest show, you're talking about a mismatch. When, when Tom told Robert Kraft... Okay, so 17 all. A minute 30 down in Tom Brady's first Super Bowl win. It was against the St. Louis Rams, I'm led to believe. So this sixth ring was against the LA Rams. And at this point, they were saying that they'd be best to just shut this drive down, take the overtime and, and go to try and win it. But Tom Brady drives them back from deep in their red zone all the way down to get them in position to win it in regular time uh, by way of a field goal. And that's exactly what happened. I'm loving this. I'm absolutely loving learning the history of, of Tom Brady's career. As a six rounder, this is gonna be your best draft pick ever. Tom Brady helped create the Patriot way. It was inside of him. We go back to that first Super Bowl. No timeouts. I didn't know that. I said, that's the bad guy. Remember how John Madden was saying, go to overtime, play for overtime. Play for overtime now. I don't think you want to force anything here. You don't want to do anything stupid. No timeouts when you're done stuff. I am not in danger. I am the danger. Well, Brady and Belichick thought differently. He has been very, very impressive with his progress. I am the one he knocks. His 4240 has been his brain and his drive. You all know exactly who I am. Here's Brady again. I've got to say, I, I mean, that pass seemed pretty damn quick. And that is in his first year in the league. So maybe the pass that I did see at the combine was a little slower than normal. I mean, he's, he's firing it. He's, he's, that's not a slow pass. By any means. That team, they won 11 games that year when they were 0 2 and 5 11 the year before. Did they win the Super Bowl? Now, same mind. Now, that picture right there is legendary. And he went and did it another six motherfucking times. Tom 
middle of next year. It's going to be the remains of Tom Brady. There's deep-rooted anger in you, Max, and I see it. I see it. And they got mad just on both sides of the ball throughout the game. You saw Tom Brady didn't have targets to throw the football to because guys just weren't getting open. There's issues on offense, too. Wide receivers are not getting open for Tom Brady. Tom Brady, 133 passing yards in a vacuum, okay, maybe it's a one-off. But then you add it to the fact that maybe Bill Belichick has been worried about him getting on in years. All anyone has ever wanted to do is doubt this guy. Crazy. The Patriots but that's sport. In trouble. They're absolutely in trouble. Patriots fans, be worried. This thing is starting to fall apart. If the Pats lose this weekend... It is officially panic time. They've lost two in a row. This team hasn't lost three in a row since 2000. New England Patriots aren't good. Not a shock, I said before the season. This is <laughs> <laughs> listen, listen to it. It does not stop. <laughs> it does not stop. They're older, they're slower. It is uncharted waters. The day we celebrate our independence day. Wait! Let's be the first to do it back to back to back. The greed is good strategy, I think, is working for all of them. Greed, for lack of a better word, is good. And 68 seconds on the clock to get out of military. Terminator is out there. It can't be bargained. They won three of their first, well, three of four. He's robotic. Him and Bill Belichick, what they do. And then, unbelievably, it was ten years until he won his fourth. Now, I am still coming to terms with that. Comeback player of the year after he injured himself. Comeback player of the year in 2009. That must mean in the years previous they thought he was done. Oh, were they so wrong. Oh, what a bomb. Josh Gordon, eh? Because if you didn't know before, you know now. You know now about Mahomes and the Chiefs. Because at this point, nobody wants to be a part of these guys. Star Wars now. <laughs> Sorry. Not Star Wars. What am I talking about? That's Batman. No, it is Star Wars. <laughs> this thing's got so many fucking different soundtracks in it. My head is exploding, but I'm enjoying it. It's Tom Brady and Bill Belichick and the Death Star. The amount of time that this guy must put in to get these sound bites from all these different things. I mean, I'd love to know ex how many hours it takes to create a 26 minute and 20 second documentary piece. 
by Joseph Vincent. Because I'm going to say it's upward of 100 hours. Now the NFL. This team has survived the next best thing in the AFC several times. The late points by New England Mahomes. Corner pattern running once Tyreek Hill. The most impressive. Touchdown! Kansas City! The board is strong. It could destroy us. <laughs> He's pumped He's just the board. And uh, Brady is... Third and goal. It just doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. None of it ever matters. <laughs> it's just win after win. Get in! You knew the power of dogs. Well, you see Brady get a lot of touchdowns on the run. Mahomes will start initially under center. Play action fake. Outside rush. Mahomes stepping up. I will never join you! 25, 20, 15, 10, mm, what a finish that was. There is no other player in the league that could have caught that and had the acceleration to turn and burn the cornerback like that. So that was in the playoff game, right? Or was that throughout the season? No, that was in the season. Okay. Man, do I need one? Tom Brady and this Tom versus Tom thing, he's given up his life for football. And what the hell do those things say? Soul, Mino, and Time. Okay. That's why he's beating Father Time right now to my shop in Chicago. No, it's his soul mind time. O three, O four, Super Bowl champ. Second year in a row, and for the third time in the last four years, the Patriots celebrate winning the Lombardi Trophy. Does he think his legacy is not cemented? I think he looks at himself as a sick old graduate, and he's always looking at himself as that. That's why he prepares. That's why he never takes any credit. To the line and for a game to sit at second down and four. They have survived the fads of offensive and defensive change. I agree. This may be the passes I've ever seen in this Patriot offense. They're not even lined up. This is amazing. They're dropping mouthpieces. They have no idea. They've never seen a pace like this. And really, neither have we. <laughs> Shit. They have survived the doubts about Tom Brady's age. Two minutes into the drive. They've already run seven players. They survived year in and year out of us trying to write them off. Wow. They run ten plays in three minutes and twenty seconds. Hyper one speed is what they got. Absolutely. But Tom Brady is he's like Jason. You, you, you can't stop him. He's so good, so incredible. It was Tom terrific get the ball with Captain America did it. He's going for the kill, buddy. So been long for New England. Oh, no wonder he loves Gronk, right? No wonder. He's got it. He goes up and gets it. I'm not buying it, just like everybody thought the Red Sox. It's exactly what he did at the Bucks. I don't think they're dynamic enough. I just don't think they have perimeter skill. Because I feel like every year we talk in the offseason about, man, how are they going to do it? I mean, they didn't, they didn't get this guy, they didn't have that guy, this guy's hurt, this guy's going to say. Do you know what I've just added to my bucket list? Seeing Tom Brady play a game of NFL football before he retires. That's on my bucket list. There were reasons to believe this year that this was the year the Pats didn't get a bump. Josh Gordon facing once again indefinite suspension for violating the terms of his reinstatement under the substance abuse policy. From a football perspective, this is pretty difficult for this football team. He's been uh, an important player. Like I said, he's carved out a, a massive role on this team today. Last now, 11-15 left for this football game. Seattle, did you forget about Seattle in the Super Bowl? That defense wanted to put TB12's pelt right on the wall. Brady's going to slip up. 
Look at this route. Bang. Turns him inside out. Scores a winning touchdown. In a, in a phone box. As the legend of Brady Grace. Dyer. What do you do in life? You go right to people that you can depend on. You are about to die in the hands of the children of the Oh no. Oh. Sherman. Sherman. Oh. 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 You poor cat. There are two more. Well, 38th all-time postseason game. It's staggering. It's at the age of 41. And the fact that he's still doing it at this level, at this age, he was the MVP of the league last year at age 40. To me, that ends any discussion. Let the games begin. That's right. He was on the cover of the first ever Madden game that I bought, Madden 18. And then I think it was Antonio Brown in 19. And then I think it was Lamar Jackson in 20. Who was it in 21? No, sorry. It was Mahomes in 20 and Lamar Jackson in 21. There you go. <laughs> He's still got that chip on his shoulder, man. He thrives off of doubt. He does. Oh, this game was unbut. Well, actually, no. Was it this game? It was. Unbelievable. Super Bowl 51. He took a little look out to the left. He knew he was passing it there. But they can't do anything about it. Oh, we've got Wolverine too. The Pats have three in the last four seasons. He's going for the kill, buddy. And Snoop Dogg. He's not going for the field goal with Gaskowski. He's going to the fun zone. <laughs> no in between. Gaskowski. Disgustingly sick. The best there is at what I do. But what I Oosh. Do. Look at that block by Edelman. Let's have a look at that. 
disgustingly sick. Look at this, Edelman's coming in. Who the hell does he clean up trying to take this running back? Nice, so he's got this number 30. This, this fella coming across, we've got 61 to block him. A 61's a big man. This is what I do. And he does exactly that, but that wasn't easy. That was certainly not easy. In fact, it only just broke the plane of the line. So, yeah, well done. Sorry, another thing on my bucket list, officially, is to go to a Chiefs home game. I think it's going to be totally wild atmosphere, and I think the Chiefs are going to come out, and I think they are going to handle the Patriots. Oh, you see Tom, he drops back, he doesn't have much open downfield, he's about to run, he sees that crease. He's about to run. Nope. No, I'm not. He pulls back up. He has two hands on the ball still. Finds his running back on a back shoulder throw. There's tight coverage. Tight coverage, all right. With 33 seconds left, here in the second quarter. Yes, the answer is the cliff has arrived. God, that Max Kellerman is a fucking hater, isn't he? Holy shit. Is he as much of a hater as we're hearing, or does he just have to be the opposite opinion of the person that he's sitting, you know, in front of on that talk show? I feel like there's a little bit of both. You've got to have arguments on, on talk shows, I get that, but god damn, he is a Tom Brady fucking hater. I want to hear what Max Kellerman said after the seventh Super Bowl ring. That's what I want to hear. Kansas City! And I think we will hear it uh, in this next video. You can have a great time, and guess what? I quarterback someone that's magic, and they can just make stuff happen. They're going to run a screen inside Damian Williams, set up 20, 15, 10, 5, touchdown! Kansas City! Kansas City! Championship game. Mahomes, three touchdown passes in this half. They're calm, they're cool, and they're going to find a way to overcome it and get the lead back. Now, who was that? Was that Peyton Manning? Let me listen. And they're going to find a way to overcome it and get the lead back. See, I'm at the stage now where I'm actually recognizing voices. And that makes me proud. Lovely block by uh, by Gronkowski there. He's still going. Look at him. Big stop. Clearly they're taking the piss, because there's there's one player and one player only, and he's right fucking there. Exactly how it's supposed to come down. Tom Brady <laughs> has 56 career comebacks. Edelman's been doing it for years. Wow. Okay. 
to compete. Two or three left, down four. It's 20 degrees outside, and the quarterback's 41 years old. Oh my gosh, Tim! <laughs> Holy shit, he was, he was off down the bloody field. He must have... He must have turned and come back about 10 yards there. Look at this. Look, Edelman's at the top of your screen, right? He's gone. He's going downfield. But no, he's he's turned. And he's come back and caught it just at the first down marker. Tom Brady just puts the superhero cape on. It's just unbelievable that he's still able to do this. And goes to Gronk when he needs him. He's such a big unit. It's literally 10 degrees with about a 3 degree wind chill up there. You can't hear anything. Everything is silent. Burkhead, the fullback. seen that before I have I've heard it before and I've fucking cracked up just like that <laughs> he's getting into him isn't he you're fucking too old mate what are you doing how how in the world are you doing this <laughs> and you know what Bill Belichick actually looks like he would sound like that voice These sound bites just get better and better. Money time. Money time is for what? Money player. Shot that down a third of that in the pocket. Throws it a little out of it over the next field. Makes the catch. Fifteen yard dagger on third and ten. Third and ten, twenty two element. Third and ten, fifteen to element. Third and ten, fifteen to ground. Gronk Edelman. Touchdown, Patriots! And they're bound for Super Bowl 53! We're going back, baby! And there ain't nothing you can do about it! America's worst nightmare is back! We're going to the fourth Super Bowl in five years! Pack your bags, start our boxes! Brady walked into the facility and said, and I quote, I am the baddest mother on the planet. It's the one that says bad <laughs> What? Baddest mother. Brady walked into the facility and said, and I quote, I am the baddest mother on the planet. He just walked into the Super Bowl facility. The field that he's about to try and win his sixth Super Bowl ring. And says, and I quote, I am the baddest mother, well you wouldn't have heard it, but I'll, 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 you know, I'll let you know exactly what he said. I am the baddest motherfucker on the planet. And it sounds like there's a Harley Davidson outside, so I apologize about that, but Tom Brady, I mean, look at him. Facility and said, and I quote, I am the baddest mother on the planet. Look at him. It's the one that said bad motherfucker. In the land of Mordor, in the fires of Mount Doom, the Dark Lord Sauron forged its secret. A master ring to control all others, and into this ring he poured his will to dominate all life. One ring to rule them all. Okay, finally, I actually got a quote. I could actually complete a, a quote from Lord of the Rings. One ring to rule them all. Um, don't ask me where I got that from, but well, I'm pretty proud of myself actually. One ring to rule them all. And Brady was being stifled back there. And then, late in the game, and I know you'll say sure, because that's what happens. The power of the ring. Brady nine Super Bowls appearances. Has a chance to win six titles. What did he do? Nine minutes left. He led a game winning drive, as he always does. As he always has done. Better than any other quarterback in the history of the game. Nice throw. Who to? I don't even need to say it, do I? He goes and hits four for four. I will show you where I have made my home. 
moves out of the family. Then I will break you. Brady chance start here. How many damn times you gotta see the movie before you know the ending? He makes the catch to 45, turns left, and when he slides down. And that guy. There's been a quarterback that can call upon his greatness time after time when they need it the most. And when they need Who the hell is that? He needs to be absolutely great. He can do it. He's gonna cut it. I'm telling you, he's gonna cut one loose right down the side. Four for four. To Gronk. Seven yards. It makes the catch. Over two defenders. Tumbling to the two. Just as happy. It's a dunk. You're not gonna believe him. He's gonna take. He's gonna dunk. Dunk you. He's gonna set you up. Guys, this is something that we're probably never gonna see again in our lifetime. It's a 29 yard strike. You should have learned. I should have learned. We all should have learned. Right again. Two separate dynasties in two separate decades. And now we're in the third decade. Six times world champion. And there ain't nothing you can do about it. But there is one constant throughout this whole 18 years. Bill Belichick and Tom Brady. But that Tom Brady is in a class by himself. Nobody brings it home like it should. Nobody. No, they don't. <sighs> there it is. Today's video was brought now this one I'm gonna really enjoy I followed this season I followed the Bucks and this is gonna really bring to a conclusion today's deep dive on the goat of American football the greatest of all time seven time Super Bowl winning champion Tom Brady um, if I call myself an NFL fan if I continue to you know um, follow this league and follow the sport it's only just, it's only right that I do watch these videos because I, I, I'm, I'm in absolute awe of this man and what he's achieved over and over and over and over again. And it doesn't matter if your quarterback is, is Patrick Mahomes. It doesn't matter if it's Lamar Jackson who runs a 4-3, 40 yard dash. I'm still going to take Tom Brady over these guys. And I, I will um, for the rest of my days. Um, the fact that he's 43 and still taking hits from these, you know, linebackers and, and 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 such is probably the most impressive thing. It's not his throwing. It's not his ability to win games. It's actually the the, the ability to take hits because it wouldn't be easy. And he's going to be waking up after every single one of these games feeling sore as fuck. So, all power to him. Can he do eight? Can he do eight? I think if they can keep the core of the Buccaneers together, there's no reason why you can't. And, um, well, in the next one, we're going to follow his journey to the Bucks and to his seventh Super Bowl ring. So guys, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for the support on the channel. If you have enjoyed this video, please like it. If you want to subscribe, please do. And I will see you in the next one. Cheers, Tom Brady. What an absolute legend.